Well, if you read the title of this video, you will know that this is Matt and he's my boyfriend. And you are going to meet him today. How do you feel with that? I'm excited. You should be. You're meeting the internet today, Matt. It's a pretty exciting thing. Um, so this is kind of his, uh, not his first, not his first Instagram. time. Yes, he's on Instagram. He just joined Instagram. But this is his first like real like YouTube video. Yeah. But enough about that. The questions. The questions. So I went onto my Instagram and I asked you guys what I should ask Matt and what you want to know about him and about us. So I'm going to take some of those as well as I'm going to just do some more, I guess, generic questions to get to know Matt a little bit better. Take my bones away. <laughs> username right <laughs> where did you both meet uh we went to high school together we did actually. go to high school together um, years and years ago years and years ago um but we weren't friends in high school no we didn't really know each other very well no but where we actually met would be through mutual friends yeah after high school when we were in when i was in university like i met you in high school i knew who you were in high school we just didn't really become Friends. Friends. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. Didn't we really knew, get to know each other yeah, until after high school. Yeah, we knew who we were in high school. Yeah. yeah, we knew each other. Alice is Bloras. How long have you been dating? This is a tricky question. Yeah. Um, because we actually dated before. Yeah. So when we met, what, a couple years after high school. Yeah. So we dated for a little while. We were when I was in university. We dated before. Yeah. It was like a long distance thing, mm -hmm. and both of our lives just kind of took us in different directions, Nadine I mean, traveled the world and went all over the place. And... I moved to like New Zealand, and I moved to like <laughs> London, and yeah. then I moved to just... You guys know me, this is my channel, you know yeah. I travel, so... But this time has been a few months now, so... Yeah. Yeah. So, so then, when was our first date? Well, <laughs> I was like, that was, again, yeah, this is a tricky, tricky question, question, because we dated before. Round so... one? Um, the first thing I remember is the zip lining in Whistler. Yeah, zip lining and Whistler. I don't even know who would be the second. I, I what, don't really count. Two? Yeah. Because we've been friends for a really long time too, yeah. in between. Like, we've always stayed friends. Yeah. But, but, it, but, so, like, what do you, uh, I. What's the zip question. lining? Zip lining. Rob J. Mendez92 asks Is he a YouTuber? No, clearly not. <laughs> But he's an Instagrammer now! <laughs> he's just started an Instagram account, so you should definitely go check it out, go follow him, and give him some tips and advice, because you're just starting up yeah. and learning all about photography uh -huh. and stuff. And so, always looking for feedback. Of course. Yeah. And who doesn't like photos? MD asks, where is he from? Vancouver, British Columbia. Where's Courtney asks? <laughs> Does he go with you on my travels? So, you've been with me on a few of my travels now. Yeah. So, well, I went on uh, three trips with you now so far. Yeah? Yeah, so Keats Island, Nova Scotia, and Mexico. Yes. So, he's been, so he has traveled with me, and you can go watch, so we did, he's in, he's in my Nova Scotia vlogs. So, you can go watch those, so you can see Matt in them. Hall of Four Beth asks, how does he cope with you going on solo travel adventures? And how often do we talk when uh, he is away or when I'm away? Um, it's obviously not ideal, but uh, I think we're both the kind of people that are okay with some alone time. Yeah. And we're both very independent. We're both very independent yeah. people. So, I mean, of course, it's not ideal with you being away all the time on mm -hmm. travels, but uh, we make it work. We make it work. And then the second part was how often do we talk when we're away? Oh, uh, well, we we keep in touch quite regularly. Yeah, I was gonna say texting and every day almost. Yeah, every day, every day at least texting every day, and then phone calls okay. when we have time. Yeah, and when, or when the yeah, time zones line up. When the time up. zones line up. And, yeah. <laughs> That's the tricky one. Yeah. When the time zones line up. Lovely, Fabi asks if two of you could travel anywhere in the world right now, where would we go? The Philippines? Yes, the Philippines! <laughs> yes! Oh my god, oh, the Philippines so bad. Warm. Uh, Canada's been so brutal, guys. Yeah, if you could see out this window right now. Mm -mm. It's been so brutal this winter. Okay, Aaron <laughs> Yip Ching asks, there's a couple questions, but I'm gonna skip to the more important question is, um, are you a dog or a cat person? I'm a cat person. My first pet was a cat. 
and we didn't have a family dog until I was older, but I was already a cat person at that time. Although I do love dogs, love dogs. We had a German Shepherd growing up and he was awesome. Love Good, dog. because you said dogs. <laughs> That's it. Chris Dave, Ralph Scott's room asked if you could do an acceptable cat impersonation. <laughs> she wants me to do a cat impersonation. <laughs> cat impersonation. <laughs> You really don't have to do a cat. Okay, we're not gonna make. I Matt, can do a cat impersonation. We're not gonna make Matt do a cat impersonation. Janine Morrell asks, "What is our favorite thing about each other?" Um, you are just really easygoing and really kind, and just the most accommodating person. <laughs> I was gonna say the same thing to you. You're so so easygoing, super chill, super relaxed. Keep going. Just, Keep going. <laughs> I mean, that's, yeah. So it works quite well, especially yeah. with travels and stuff too, because yeah. you need to be. You have to be easygoing and kind and of very just, compromisable yeah. because yeah. Accommodating. Stuff happens. Very typical Canada right now. Super typical Canada. Shannon 4 asks, "Is he vegan?" No, I'm not vegan. Um, I'm not opposed to it. It's not something I'm against. It's just not something I've really gotten into. I like my meats. I really like my dairy though, so that'd be a tough one to give up. Mm, dairy's off. Oh, dairy's so good. Rapid fire. Rapid fire cool. round. What would you eat every day if you could? Mm, Mexican food. Tacos. Really? <laughs> I, I was going to say bagels. Well, I already eat that every day, so. Mm. Yeah. yeah, but what if you had to stop eating bagels? <laughs> What if the bagels had to stop? I could replace them with tacos. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um, what would you eat every day? Sushi. Sushi? Yeah, good call. Veggie. Good or, call. Well, obviously vegan veggie sushi. Yeah. But like, I eat sushi for breakfast. Literally? Yeah, literally. I've had sushi for breakfast many times. Because yeah. I'm just like, oh, what do I want to eat? Sushi. sushi. What's the one food you don't like? The one food I don't like? Yeah. Mmm. I recently tried anchovies for the first time. Ooh. Don't like those. Oh. Don't like those. All right. Favorite music? I'm like uh, alternative indie rock kind of thing. Yeah. Favorite sports team? Vancouver Canucks. Really? Yeah. Maybe circa 2010. Yeah. I mean, maybe not right now, but. <laughs> <laughs> so. That's Matt. Well, that's like an intro. <laughs> <laughs> that's everything about me. <laughs> that's everything you need to know. That's, that's all there is. So we are planning on doing some more travels, a bunch more travels this year. You'll see me Hopefully, again. Hopefully, yeah, you'll see him again. Um, but if you have any more questions, head over to his Instagram, check it out. Give him some pointers you can ask there. Um, and also don't forget to follow me on my Instagram because I've got a bunch of awesome cool new photos that are going to be coming out and it was nice to meet you, Internet. All right. Well, I'm gonna leave some links down below, um, and also go. You can go watch Nova Scotia videos too yeah. if you want to see that. Bye. Bye.